How nice would it be to have a selection of preset prompts available, either positive and or negative, which are added to the prompt text that you type yourself. Well, that is possible with an add-on called Prompt Styler. Here we have it, the SDXL Prompt Styler. And I added a prompt over here and I selected from this style list fantasy art and this is what came out. Well, let's first see how it works, then let's see how we can install it and then see how we can modify the presets to our own personal liking. So I can now select a, another style, say photographic and render this image again with the exact same prompt and the exact same seed of course and then yeah we can already see it growing and we get a photograph uh, and well let's do one other uh, let's select art style watercolor uh, where is it uh, here art style watercolor let's render it again and let's see what comes out uh, this is of course yeah, really very handy because with just one click you can add a positive and a negative text uh, to the prompt that you wrote down here yourself. And so we see that it is really working. Let's now see how we can install it. Well, as usual, that is very easy. I assume you have installed the Comfy UI Manager. If you have not yet, then please look up in a previous video how to do that. Uh, and from there, it is super easy. Install custom notes. Then we do a search for Styler. And there are three entries over here we have the original prompt styler that's the one that i have installed you could also opt for a new customized version by someone who added a whole lot of styles and artists so if you would prefer that have a look here at this github site and maybe you prefer to install that one so uh, that is all for the install and then you should have it available. Next question. Can I change these styles and can I write my own positive and or negative prompt? Yes, we can. To change or add styles, we have to go to uh, the custom notes inside your comfy UI folder. Find custom notes and in the custom notes find sdxl prompt styler and inside that folder you have a couple of style folders json files and simply edit those or you can also change the names as long as they start with sdxl styles i created here an rb that's my name file let's uh, open that file with notepad plus plus we start with a square bracket and here at the bottom the opposite one and then in between curly brackets and separated by a comma but for the last one that does not have a comma uh, we add uh, yeah, sets of uh, these uh, a name that's the name that will pop up here in the in the drop down list then the positive prompt is over here. You can add words uh, uh, to it in the front or in the end. And the prompt that you wrote yourself will be inserted here. Then you can also have a negative prompt that will also be added to what you wrote in the negative prompt. Uh, so I created a default which actually does nothing. So I get only the text that I added myself in the prompt fields uh, and then I have a couple of negative ones uh, so in the positive prompt nothing changes but I add two words to the negative prompt ugly or deformed and well a negative two prompt has a couple of more words and a negative three prompt again a couple more negative words 
and so in this way you can create your own styles of course you can also add photography or cinematic or whatever but a lot of those are already available so look what you are missing edit uh, uh, what you uh, want to add to these styles and there you go you have a very easy way to select a positive or negative prompt or a combination in one click thank you for watching maybe see you back in the next video and in the meantime have fun